Okay, kiddos, welcome to another installment of Reading with Dr. G. Here we have a story about this slimy, pinkish, reddish, oozy-looking creature that doesn't have any eyes. It doesn't have anything. No arms, no legs, no tail. Maybe it's all one big tail. It's an animal made entirely out of a tail. Oh, that's crazy. <clears throat> you might call it a worm. It's not any kind of worm. It's a very special worm. It's this kind of worm right here. E-A-R says ear. But when you add a T-H that says th, it doesn't become an earth. It becomes an earthworm. Earthworm. It's a worm of the earth. It must be important if it gets to be named after the earth. Okay, guys, it's a nonfiction book. What does that mean? It's about real stuff. It's going to teach us all about earthworms why is that important to know i have no idea if you know why it's important to know about earthworms pause the video and tell someone someone right away your brother cousin uncle sister neighbor stuffed animal or dog and i'll see you back when you're ready otherwise off we go we have this thing called the title page and it is a page with a title on it and it is gross there's a whole bunch of animals made out of just tails and in there's the title, All About Earthworms. Apparently, they are very social creatures and like to hang out with each other. Where are they, though? It's just, it's just tail, body. There's no head, eyeballs. I don't know what we're looking at. <gasps> Woo! Look at that. That is, that is, that is something, huh? It's just... Look at this weird part right here. It's like a collar or a band, but there's no arms anywhere. How does he move around? Look at this. This is the introduction of the story. The author is just trying to build all kinds of crazy excitement by throwing at us this exclamation point saying, get excited, people. So let's try it. Okay, you remember this word? It's not earthworms. It's earthworms. What's this word? Well, what does a pirate say? R. Earthworms are. A.M. says, well, A says A. A, but A.M. says Am. Am. Amaz. Amaz. I.N.G. says Ing. Amazing. Amazing, man. Doesn't that sound so close to a word we already know? I'm telling you, words have crazy rules. There's no reason why that gets to say A, but he's going to say A this time. So we're going to say A. Just say A. M.A.Z. is maze. Amaze. Amaze. And I.N.G. says Ing. Now, we have to say it like it, it really is amazing, as gross as this story might be. Earthworms are amazing. Did you sell it? Did I sell it? Sell you on it yet? Are we sold? Do we think it's amazing? I mean, how can it be amazing? It has no arms, no legs. It's just a big tail. And there's a big hand holding a lot. They're little. They're little, and they're covered in dirt, and they're shiny and gooey looking. I am not amazed yet. Find out. There's that big word, but don't be scared. We know it. It's not earthworm. It's earthworms. This word right here, L-I-V. There's a silent E that should say I, but I don't know. Live. Earthworms live. That sounds very close to a word we know, don't we? Let's make it a short E. L says L. I says now. I. Live. Definitely makes more sense. Reread. Confirm more choice. Always. Earthworms live. Here's a nice little sight word in. Now look at this word right here. S says, but O-I is a super vowel team to get together and say, oi. Everyone try it, oi. You add an L, you got oil. Earthworms live in oil. Don't let them fool you. Put that S sound back on. Soil. What's soil? The black stuff. Maybe it's another word for dirt. Okay, there's a long sentence right here, right? Okay, guys, let's try this out. M says, mm, O says, O or A, ah, S, T is a blend that says, T. Let's try it. Must earthworms. Must earthworms? Not really. Does it make sense? Well, let's make that O say O this time. Mm, o earthworms. I think we like that better, don't we? <gasps> There's that really fun word. What do pirates say? R. And then we have this nice little word over here. S M. Blend up the ghosts. Mm, a L is a sight word that says all you say small. Let's reread that to make it make sense because I am not getting anything right now. Most earthworms are small. Well, that makes sense. Picture power would definitely tell you they're small. 
Not the first thing I think of though when I see a picture of a gooey looking thing. Whoa! Did we just have our mind blown or what? Was that a wow moment? The author just pulled out one of their big guns and wowed us right there. That deserves the exclamation point of amazing, doesn't it? Yikes! And this lady is loving it! Woo! It's at night, too. This is nighttime. I guess the big guys come out at night, people. And uh, it's a double fister here. She's got two hands on this thing. It's like a snake. Ooh, imagine what it must feel like. Look at that. What is that? Is that its mouth right there? Who knows? Okay. I see something that looks familiar. Definitely. We know this word. It says earthworms. And this isn't live. It is live. Earthworms live in... What do they live in? Not dirt. Oil. Soil. We have just unlocked pattern power, guys. Earthworms live in soil. It looks like the first sentence is always going to be that pattern. Woo! I don't know about two sentences. They can be tough. But we are going to have an easy time now, now that we know that first sentence. Okay, guys, there's a new word here. It is a sight word. If you don't know the sight word, it's okay. We need to say S. S-O says so, but in this case, it doesn't because it would be soam. 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 You're like, maybe. Try it. Soam earthworms. It sounds so close to something you know already, doesn't it? Try it a different way. Use a short O. Ah. Some. Some. Try it again. Keep going. Some earthworms. You know the pirate. R. Now, picture power is right here. This is all picture power. What is he? Big. Try it. B. IG says, Ig, we got a big earthworm. One more time. Read it. Smooth it all out. Some earthworms are big. and He is big. Or she, or it. Okay, okay. This one looks pretty big too, but you know, it's like just chilling out in the ground. There's little bitty plants. I guess this is him, his way of saying hi to us. Hello, Mr. Earthworm. How are you? Oh, not too close. Okay, you like your space. Ah, the pattern is still there. This is so fun. Watch. Say it with me. Earthworms live in soil. And now we know this word. It came back. They're flip-flopping the first word. And these are hard first words, so I get it. Mm, remember, it's a short O, long O. I don't know. Let's just try. Most. That makes sense, doesn't it? Most. Look, they're twinning. Earthworms. There's the pirate R. All right, this is a color word. When you look at that, what color do you think it is? Let me help you a little bit. BR is a blend that says burr. OW is a super duper vowel consonant team there that gets together and they say, oh, well, oh just kind of says his name. Oh, he's like, hey, W, take a break. I'm just going to say, oh, here. So BRO, this is bro. What's up, bro? But that is not a color, bro, is it? Now we need that N at the end. Mm, so say brone. Brone, that doesn't make sense. But OW makes another sound. It can say ow. Brow. Brow. Like, woo! Brow. Thank good I knew. Thank goodness I knew that rule. Brown. Now that makes sense. But we use so much letter power on that. We gotta go back and use reread power to smooth it all out. Because there's, there's that's the only way we're gonna become content experts on these kind of stories. Reread to learn more. Most, right? Not most. Most earthworms are brown. All right, so we're on the lookout for big brown or small earthworms. Oof. He is not brown. He is like bright red with a hint of purple, and he's tying himself into a knot. I, I don't know. Maybe that's how they have fun. They're wrestling. They're wrestling. They're wrestling worms. That's fun. That's how they have fun. Little known fact, they like to wrestle. Okay, this is the pattern, ladies and gentlemen. Let's use our reread power. Earthworms live in soil. Now we get to the tricky part here. Okay, look, they flip-flopped back to this word. It's not soam. It's uh, su. Some earthworms are. There's your trick word. Red. Red. Some earthworms are red. That was an easy one. The author gave us a break on that one. Woo! Mind blown once again with an exclamation point. Amazing. Is that a blue earthworm? How did he get blue? Did he eat blue? Does he eat blueberries? Eesh. He likes water. Look at him. He loves water. Maybe the water's blue? It makes him blue? I don't know. I don't, I don't know what they do. Like, again, looks like a big tail. 
Okay, anyway, either which way, fire up your pattern power. Here it is. Earthworms live in soil. Boy, they really tried to fool us here, but they're 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 easy little words. Here's A. All right, this word F says F. E says E. Eh, w says W. F. You know that doesn't make sense. So you got to use a special rule here. E and the W, they get together like the O and the W. It's a crazy little vowel team. It doesn't say ow. It says ew, right? When you, that face you made when you first saw the cover of the story, ew. Add that F back in now. Few. Let's try that again. Let's confirm that word choice. We read a few earthworms that still makes sense so i think we're golden a few earthworms there's that pirates and r a few earthworms are and you know it's the color word right bl let's how do you know it's blue well you, you can show off to your friends with your letter power bl says bull ue what a tricky super team this is say ew again blue let's reread that make it sound really smooth a few earthworms are blue. I think that deserves an exclamation point. That was exciting. Woo! Super close up. No need to zoom in any further. Ooh, we're doing it anyway. Oh, my goodness. Do you see that? Do you see that? Do you see that? And that. And that. There's like little hooks or spikes on the side of him. I wonder what he uses those for. I don't. Okie dokie, karaoke, here we go. Pattern power fired up to 11. Earthworms live in soil. Oh, there's a new word here. It's a sight word. If you don't know, it's okay. A says, ah, L says, ooh, owl. Owl earthworms. Does that make sense? Probably not, but it gets close. It gets you really close to a word you know. Try it again. Say, oh. Now let's keep going. All earthworms. That definitely makes sense. Here's a new sight word they're throwing at us. H A V. Ha! Like you're laughing. Ha ha ha. Now add a V. v. Ha! It could be a have with the E at the end, but some earthworms have or some words have. You know which one makes sense. Now, look at this word here. R says er. Now, this is a really awesome uh, word family. R N G says ing. Like ring and king and sing and bling. So we have a ring, and at the X we have rings. No, wait, what rings? Like rings? Let's reread that. All earthworms have rings. I didn't see any rings. Did you see rings? Like where? Where's the rings? Unless they mean these are the rings right here. I guess these are rings. Okay. If that's what they want to call it. Woo! Look at that batch of earthworms. Somebody just hit gold here. Black and red gold. Half somebody, whoever took this picture was probably like, wowzers, that's awesome. I guess they're all just wrestling together here, having a good old time. Um, woo, we got a lot of new words here, guys. This is important. Maybe it's the last page. I don't know. Look, there's that big scary word, the biggest scary word in the whole wide world, and you know it already. It's called earthworms. Mmm. Now there's a silent E at the end that says, hey, bro, try saying A. Let's do it. Mm a -k make. Let's reread that. Confirm that word choice. Some earthworms. Oh, some. Look at me. Crazy pattern power is over, fella. Earthworms make. T-H. Stick your tongue out. The. Earthworms make the. There's that word. O-I-L says oil soil. We got to keep rereading because this is tricky stuff. Earthworms make the soil. G. Uh, double O say uh, good. Now the D that says duh. We have good. What's good? Some. Oh, I, love, I, I feel like it needs to be some. But apparently all. It should be all earthworms. But it's not even all in there. Earthworms make the soil good. Good for what, you might ask. Look over here. F-O-R. F says F-O-R says or for. Earthworms make the soil good for. G-R is an awesome blend that says grrr. O-W says, just says oh. There's a perfect example where the W doesn't get to talk. G-R-O says grow. The W is silent. I-N-G says ing. Growing. Growing what? P-L says pull. A-N-T says ants. Growing ants. No. 
plans. Let's put it all together, guys. I have a feeling this is the conclusion. We got to bring it home, everybody. Reread with me. Earthworms make the soil good for growing plants. Voila! Look at all that fun green stuff hiding there. Hiding. Well, flourishing is the big boy word. All right, that is the end of our story. We're Earthworms as amazing as you, as the author wanted us to believe. That is your call. We did learn some interesting facts, though. Like, blue. Mind blown. Anyway, guys, if you want to be a super reader like me one day, remember, you must read your letters and letter sounds every day. Read your sight words every day. And read as much as you possibly can, because practice makes you perfect at everything. Until then, I'll see you at the next story. Toodaloo.